Hello everyone. Magic mirror glass is the main part of a mirror TV. So how do we make a perfect mirror? The key is the balance between the live transmittance and the reflection rate. We've been working for years to control the balance and find the right balance from the point of view of TV and mirror performance. We tested many type of mirrors from different suppliers. To control this balance between the light transmittance and the reflection rate, we do a simple test. So we need a lux meter and we turn on the TV and put up a white picture at the background. Then place the sensor as close as possible to the surface of the mirror to avoid other light influence. Keep recording the brightness data from different locations of the mirror surface. Get an average brightness level after getting all the data. And then you can compare the brightness with the original brightness of panel and calculate what's the light transmittance rate of the mirror. For example, if the average brightness is 200 CD per meter squared and the original brightness of the panel is 500 CD per meter squared, it means the transmitter rate is about 40%. For example, we have a type of mirror with 25% of light transmittance rate. It looks fine when the TV is off. The mirror performance is acceptable, but when the TV is on, it's hard to see the picture due to high reflection. The light in the panel was reduced by a lot, so the brightness is really low. We tested a sample with 60% light transmittance rate. It has come out with a good picture on the TV when it is on. The brightness is much better, but when the TV is off, we can clearly see a black screen area in the middle of the glass. It doesn't look like a full mirror glass, but more like a black frame glass. One new type magic mirror lets through 40% of light. It allows more light to go through the mirror glass and keep a good mirror reflection. Subscribe to our channel and follow our further news.